What's up guys, I got a review of the Geotech EX01 Bluetooth headset for the PS3. Um, so stick around and check it out. So here's the headset. Um, just wanted to point out, I pointed out some of the stuff in the uh, unboxing, but here's the micro USB. This is the volume up the power slash mute and the volume down button and there is this isn't a uh, button <clears throat> on the bottom it's it's a replaceable earpiece that's that's part of the earpiece that you can replace and you can switch it out and you get one that comes with it you get a, um, a, a one for the left ear and you just pretty much pop it out of place and you just switch it out switch them out and you can use it on your left ear it's pretty uh, pretty easy to do and you just put it back in there and put the little face plate back on it and you're good to go now let's talk about the performance of the headset the audio quality on this was was uh was very good it wasn't I, I didn't have a problem communicating with anybody um Everybody I talked to said they could hear me very clearly, and and it wasn't mumbled or fuzzy at all. On the audio out end, it's the headset that goes into your ear. It's a little bit quiet. I've had it all the way up, the volume all the way up, and it's a little bit harder to hear people than on some of your normal or regular in-ear Bluetooth headsets. But that doesn't mean you still can't hear people might have just been that some people um, <clears throat> I was playing with just didn't have their mic set very loud but I, I did hear most of the people I played with I, I heard them fairly fairly decently I heard them well enough to hear what they were saying and everything to sync it all you do is hold down the power button I forget how many seconds it is but it'll you'll be able to see this it'll flash between I think blue and green there it is that's how you sync it, and then you just go on your PS3 and sync it up, and you're good to go. And just enter the passcode. So let's go ahead and get out of that. Another nice feature this has is when you turn it on, <clears throat> as I stated earlier, you have a, um, oops, put it in parry mode again. You only have to hold it down for a couple seconds to turn it on. There you go. When you want to mute the headset, all you have to do is just press the button once. And then it will, you'll hear a little a beeping noise in the headset through here. <clears throat> and that'll indicate to you that it, it doesn't pick up volume. And the mute works very well. The headset also gets pretty decent, I've found, battery life. It gets about five to six hours on a full charge, which is uh, pretty good. And now I want to talk about uh, the comfort of the headset. It is a pretty long headset. It's, it's not the, your ordinary sized headset. Or Bluetooth headset for the PS3. It's uh, about twice as long, probably, as most standard Bluetooth headsets. So it's uh, definitely a, a unique headset. It um, <clears throat> it is very lightweight, though. I'll say that. So you, you don't really notice that it's a long, bigger, long and bigger headset, which is good. All right. So here's the headset on my. Uh on my ear. As you can see it's a pretty long headset. It's it's not like your ordinary ones. But it's very lightweight, it's very comfortable I found. I've been able to wear it about five, six hours without uh without getting any sort of earache or anything. It's uh it's a really comfortable headset. And uh <clears throat> it fits over your ear pretty well and snug but uh sometimes it it can come loose. But it, it usually, for the most part, it stays there, and it's uh, pretty good to not move around. And you can still get good uh, voice quality. All right, guys, that's pretty much it for my review. I uh, hope you enjoyed it, and thanks for watching.